The Miami Dolphins were off Friday as they began a three-day break before they start full on preparations for their Week 1 matchup against the New England Patriots. But the team still was active in making moves, specifically as it pertains to the practice squad. The Dolphins officially signed two players to the practice squad Friday, one of them being veteran cornerback Jamal Perry and the other rookie linebacker Milo Eifler. Perry was released Wednesday when the Dolphins claimed defensive back Elijah Campbell from the New York Jets. Eifeler also comes from the Jets, with whom he spent training camp after signing as an undrafted free agent. He played collegiately at the University of Washington in Illinois, where he was coached by former NFL players Napoleon Kaufman and Hardy Nickerson, respectively. His best season came in 2019 at Illinois when he played 13 games and had 63 tackles, including 10 for loss, with two sacks. Also on Friday, the Dolphins released Jordan Scarlett from the practice squad. The running back from the University of Florida was among the players cut when the Dolphins got to the 53-player limit Tuesday. The Dolphins now have their full practice squad roster set, and it includes Brazilian guard Derval Queiroz Neto, who still carries an exemption and doesn't count against the 16-player limit. So the 17 on the practice squad are running back Garrett Dokes, running back Patrick Laird, wide receiver Kirk Merritt, Jason Strobridge, cornerback Javaris Davis, cornerback Tino Ellis, Cameron Tom, quarterback Reed Sinnott, Adam Pankey, linebackers Shaquem Griffin, linebackers Calvin Munson, wide receiver Brandon Powell, linebackers Keon Smith, Jabal Sherd, K. Raz, Perry and Eifler. All but Powell, Smith, Sherd and Eifler were in Dolphins training camp. As a reminder, the Dolphins will be allowed to protect four from being poached by another team this week and can designate those four by 4 p.m. Tuesday. Numbers Game The roster on the Dolphins' website now lists rookie safety Javon Holland with the number 8, which is what he wore in college. Rookie free agent cornerback Trill Williams is expected to switch to 6, though the change isn't official on the site. The numbers 6 and 8 were worn in training camp by a couple of wide receivers who ended up on injured reserve, Lynn Bowden Jr. and Alan Hearns, respectively.